Manifesting your dreams into physical reality is a transformative journey. It parallels the act of planting a seed in fertile soil, nurturing it, and witnessing its growth into a robust, fruitful plant. Just as the first step in this process involves preparing the soil, your subconscious mind must also be primed for manifestation. By default, our subconscious is often unprepared due to years of unconscious conditioning and programming. It resembles a field cluttered with waste, consisting of past thoughts, traumas, and anxieties that need to be cleared before planting the seed of your desires. Cultivating self-awareness stands as one of the most powerful tools to achieve this clearing process. By developing self-awareness, you gain insight into the thoughts and beliefs that hinder your progress. That's precisely why I emphasize the importance of meditation in my videos. Meditation serves as an invaluable and accessible tool. It helps calm racing thoughts and relaxes the nervous system, shifting your focus from external distractions to the place where creation happens, the inner realm. Regular meditation transforms you into an observer of your own thoughts, moods, and behavior. This state of self-awareness becomes the fundamental step towards manifestation. When you recognize your thought patterns, and their corresponding emotional responses, you can be vigilant in avoiding negative thoughts. According to Neville Goddard, the moods you embody shape your state of being, which, in turn, manifests your reality. It all starts with a single thought that captures your attention, activating related neural networks in your brain. These thoughts then trigger corresponding emotions, leading to the formation of a mood. As that mood lingers over time, it becomes integrated into your personality, aligning your outer world with your inner landscape of feelings and emotions. This cycle exemplifies the essence of manifestation. Regardless of whether you believe in the law of assumption, the law of attraction, or another principle, the underlying principles remain consistent. Self-awareness proves invaluable throughout this journey. As you cultivate it further through meditation, you develop the ability to halt a thought just as it begins influencing your emotions. The more you meditate, the more adept you become at this practice. With ample self-awareness and consistent meditation, you can effectively clear the waste from the soil of your subconscious. Subsequently, the next step involves preparing the soil to accommodate the planting of your desires. Preparing the soil in this context refers to establishing a positive self-concept before embarking on your manifestation journey. Your self-concept encompasses the deep-rooted ideas you hold about yourself. Many of us harbor a victim mentality, feeling subject to the whims of the universe. Such a perspective relinquishes our power to external forces. It is crucial to monitor your thoughts about yourself when you are alone. If you notice negative or compromised thoughts, focus on creating a strong belief in yourself and your life path. Understand that you are an integral part of the universe, an essential component of the whole, a source of energy. You were created to experience the best that being human offers on planet Earth. Your desires guide you towards the potential you are fully capable of attaining. However, realization hinges on the extent of your self-belief. Begin affirming positive statements about yourself and your life. Refrain from dwelling on past grievances, as that narrative belongs to the past. If you perpetuate that story, you will find no solace in the present moment, nor will you possess the courage to create a magnificent future for yourself. Positive affirmations prove highly beneficial in reinforcing your self-concept. Regularly tell yourself statements such as, I am the best, everything is possible for me, I am blessed beyond imagination, and the universe supports and guides me on my life path. By consistently repeating such affirmations, your self-concept will undoubtedly undergo transformation. Start incorporating them into your daily routine from this moment forward. Now, let's delve into the most common mistake people make during the manifestation process. Many individuals successfully navigate the initial stages of self-awareness and enhancing their self-concept. Subsequently, they move on to the crucial step of planting the seed of their desires in the fertile soil of the subconscious. Countless methods can be employed to achieve this, but one particularly promising approach is visualization. Find a quiet place where you can sit with your eyes closed for a while. 
Take a few moments to connect with your inner self, allowing your mind to settle. Once in this state, create a vivid mental image that reflects the fulfillment of your desired outcome. Since the mind cannot distinguish between emotions generated by external circumstances and those created solely by our thoughts, we can trick our minds into perceiving our visualizations as reality. This method serves as the most effective means of impressing your desires onto the layers of your subconscious. However, after impressing the desire or planting the seed, most people make a critical mistake. They grow impatient. Allow me to elucidate the entire process using an analogy that resonates with all of us. Planting the seed is not synonymous with immediately obtaining the fully grown plant. We understand that this natural process requires time. Thus, it is crucial not to question your skills or your luck during this period or succumb to impatience. Instead, let go of the thought you have planted and trust that it will grow. It must grow. It is the law. When you begin questioning the timing and doubting your ability to manifest, you align yourself with negative vibrations. This energy will never lead you toward fruitful outcomes. Rather than obsessing over when your desire will materialize, focus on personal growth, nurture positive thoughts, indulge in uplifting music, and take inspired actions that contribute to your goal if necessary. This equates to watering the seed. Your positive attitude and high vibrations will undoubtedly expedite the manifestation process. Even if you cannot perceive physical results immediately, refrain from doubting the process for a while. This is precisely why I recommend starting with small desires or manifesting inconsequential things. By manifesting minor aspects, you bolster your belief in the overall process, enabling you to tackle more significant manifestations. From the universe's perspective, there is no distinction between big and small desires. Every wish can be granted. However, the challenge arises when you become overly attached to a desire, inadvertently attempting to control the outcome. Whether you rush the process or succumb to doubt, envisioning worst-case scenarios, you waste your time and energy, sabotaging your manifestation. After you have done your part, it is essential to surrender gracefully, if possible, Keep your desire to yourself and refrain from sharing it with others. Their impatience may influence your own. They might repeatedly inquire about your desire, leading you to believe that it has not manifested yet. Thus, if your desire holds significant importance to you, keep it a secret and continue nurturing it with positive thoughts and assumptions. The universal law always works, regardless of the situation, ensuring that your desire will be granted. However, you must exercise patience and possess an inner knowing that everything is aligning and coming together for you. Neville expresses that doubt is the sole force capable of disrupting the seed or impression. To prevent a miscarriage of this remarkable child, maintain secrecy throughout the necessary period until the impression transforms into expression. Revel in the joy and confidence of keeping your secret within assured that you will eventually give birth to the manifestation of your desires. In doing so, you will uncover the mystery of God's words. Let us make man in our image.